Hello friends, so in this tutorial we will see how to generate impulse signal in MATLAB. So a typical uh, impulse signal looks like similar to this way. So it shows value high at only a particular instant of time. For example, at t is equal to 0 the value is high. For all the rest of values, the positive values and the negative values, it is not showing high value so it shows uh, it means that all the values are low except at t is equal to zero so let's try to plot this type of graph in matlab so i'll just write the heading by starting with percentage uh, percentage so this does not uh, this makes it as a comment which it will not consider it in the actual code so impulse signal impulse signal generation this is just for our reference so I'll consider a set of values for variable a from minus phi to phi semicolon so I'll display the values of A. So these are all the values available. Uh, I have selected for variable A from minus 5 to 5. And let's consider another variable B. As we have a special built-in function in MATLAB that is zeros, which will turn all these values into zeros. I'll just write the syntax of it in square brackets. 0 z e r o s zeros and in the bracket we have from i want zeros for all the values except at zero position 0 1 comma 5 1 comma 5 bracket close and i'll just write 1 here and zeros again open the bracket 1 comma 5 and close the square bracket semicolon so we have a and b and we'll plot the graph now by using a, another special command that is stem of a comma b semicolon and let's see how it appears in the graph it is getting generated now so you can see it is showing high at only at a particular instant at zero position and all rest all it is showing low value this is because of this command zeros i have made all these commands as zeros except at one position which is a high position that is why it is showing high at a particular instant of time so let's see let's close this one for time being let's see the uh, if how we'll get the graph when we use plot command p l o t plot a comma b semicolon and press enter and you can see the difference between the stem and plot command so at stem it uses discrete values at a particular instant of time but a plot command uses continuous values so that is the reason why it is coming like this way and to compare it with com another stem a comma b C. dot a comma b this is coming as a discrete command 
just write x and similarly we can write the x-axis name the x-axis and y-axis x-axis we have time and y label we have values and the title as the title as impulsive impulse signal so this was about the impulse signal and the difference between the step command and plot command in MATLAB step it shows discrete values at a particular instant of time whereas plot shows the continuous set of values we have seen both the set of graphs for same function so this was about the impulse signal generation in MATLAB